All right, so our last topic is, um, I don't know, there was an article recently where you know the story. I don't know why you're not saying it. <laughs> All right, so there's an article saying that, um, that actually Steven Spielberg said that superhero films were going to go the way of westerns and just fall off the face of the earth. Um, he thinks that you know it's oversaturated and it's going to continue to be oversaturated and that people are just going to get tired of the same formula over and over again. So, thoughts? I mean, okay, I can see what he's saying because right so, now we are get, we are just being inundated with superhero movie after superhero series after so, superhero short. Let me ask you a question. What is a superhero movie? What makes a superhero movie to you? Um, a movie starring <laughs> a superhero. I don't understand pretty, the question. Okay, it's pretty generic. <laughs> it's pretty bland. But I mean, I think there are different types. See, but... I'm thinking that the movies that they're putting out now are not just cliche superhero movies. Like, you have Ant-Man, which I believe was a comedy. Mm -hmm. Captain America, which I feel is like an espionage spy film. Yeah, I feel like they're, they're definitely putting out fall, different genres. Yeah, they, they fall yes, in different they genres. Yes, they include superheroes in them, mm -hmm. but they're not, you know, the Like the Dark Knight trilogy, that was more of like a... Hyper-realistic... Detective um, drama. Crime drama. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, it goes on and on. You have Thor with the Norse mythology. Yeah. Um, type film you've got yeah so they have a, a big and you have the classic cliche superhero films like age of ultron avengers those types of films yeah very comic booky yeah yeah but see i don't see them um becoming oversaturated I, actually they might become <laughs> they are going to become oversaturated but i don't see them dying out like the like the westerns <clears> did <throat> just because uh you know westerns are a little bit more one-dimensional i thought like mm -hmm. western you're, you're in the wild wild west and there's only so many stories you can tell yeah but you can go anywhere with comic book culture. really <laughs> in the cosmos <clears throat> but yeah. um yeah i i think I, there's another article i read where um emma stone no not emma stone emma watson was saying that um if she has to see like she feels the same way steven spielberg does like if she has to see another spider-man uh, origin story she's gonna like put her head through a wall <laughs> which i feel her on well, because that's all of us. yeah oh god i do not want to see another spider-man origin story i don't care about his origins they're anymore. not gonna do it anymore good they With shouldn't the new one coming out in 2017 yeah so i mean yeah i can definitely see you know their point yeah. because it's just non-stop i mean we're getting everybody now but see they're lumping all of the superhero movies into one category no yeah. these superhero movies have their own categories of their own um in terms of the niches that they try to hit yeah like marvel's not doing the same thing with every single movie so. yeah and dc the dc uh, oh they're gonna go totally movie different. universe is gonna be completely different from what we're getting with marvel so yeah yeah i agree not with uh with them <laughs> with you 